It's a time-honored tradition in Montana. When the temperatures drop, skiers ascend for that first taste of winter's bounty. Well, skiing and snowboarding in, in Montana is just a perfect fit because Montanans love being in the mountains. We love to be outdoors. Uh, we're not afraid of the weather, and it's just really a, a, a peaceful and fun uh, experience that we can do with people of all ages. For the crew at Red Lodge Mountain, the kickoff to ski season is the culmination of months of planning and hard work. There's a lot of teams that are working together to make opening day a success. Ski Patrol has a lot to do on the mountain to get prepared. Our groomers have to move snow around and prepare the slopes. Food and beverage has a lot to do to get each one of our uh, dining uh, operations up and running and ready to go. We've got all the rental fleet of equipment tuned and waxed and ready to go, uh, making sure all the facilities are in uh, top-notch condition for our guests. Prepping rentals and stocking pantries took a backseat to one issue that was out of their hands. Because we had a warm fall, it was, it was definitely warmer than average through October and November here. Uh, that, that number one means that we're not getting as much natural snow as we like. But ever prepared, teams managed to have a backup plan to ensure there was snow on the ground for Friday's big opening. Obviously we count on Mother Nature to bring us some snow, but we also have a pretty extensive snow making system. So we've been blowing snow on and off since the first week of November. So we've seen some snow and we're hoping that we're going to get some more later this week. Ask and you shall receive. And if you need any more convincing to come to Red Lodge. The first big dump that comes and you get out there and you get to make fresh tracks in that powder, there's just nothing like it. At Red Lodge Mountain, Travis Schlepp, MTN News.